I know. I can't believe it either. Really can't. <laughs> Kicking off the office, no car. In fact, today it's going to be a car free zone. I am <laughs> sick of the car, but uh, lots to do today, so it's definitely not going to be a uh, an easy day. It is just after nine, as we can see, and um, I've got loads to do today. I've got a video to record to go along with today's article, which I was just going to publish straight out the gate. Um, and then add the video in later, but I'm up and in the office early, so I'm gonna get that video done now and hopefully get it all out together. And um, my goal is to try and get the article published and the video embedded and everything else by eleven o'clock. Um, so recording that video shouldn't take too long. It's the editing that can be sometimes a little troublesome. So we'll see how we go there. I also need to record a Q and A for today. Um, get that published and. Uh, the Facebook teaser for that has to go out. Today's vlog has to be edited, although today's vlog is really simple because it's pretty much just two cuts of me in the car. One on the way to work, one on the way home from work, so there's not going to be too much editing involved in that. And I also want to get a start on the editing for the podcast that goes out on Thursday. That's the episode of Chris Ducker that you've seen us record last week. Uh, that'll go out this coming Thursday. Um, so you'll see that that. Yeah, that'll be on Thursday. Yeah, so I need to get that ready to go um, as well. And I need to make a start on next Tuesday's article because this coming weekend is so hectic that I don't want to leave everything till Monday because I'm at a wedding on Friday and Saturday. I have a christening on Sunday. Uh, so Monday, I may not be the most productive I've ever been. That's kind of my way of saying I'll probably be hungover and uh, living with the fear in hell but apart from that uh yeah it's a good day so i'm not going to spend too much time talking to you um because i really want to get this done so i'm going to quickly finish my cup of coffee and aim to start recording at 9 30. i'm hoping to have all my recording done by 10 by 10 and get my editing done by 11. let's get after it how does that look no just kind of get this shut up see this this is the problem with lenses Oh, oh. You kind of have to make sure that you don't get shadows. Okay, that looks a little bit better. Let's try that for the videos. Right, Q&A is now recorded. Um, I've got the footage uploading to the Mac and now I've really got to get to editing. It is 20 to 11. So I kind of set a goal of 11 o'clock of having the article published with the video and everything else. So yeah, I'm going to have to go and hurry to try and meet that deadline. Although I got a bit distracted with another piece of software that I kind of went playing with. And I shouldn't have. So I lost a half an hour in procrastination and software. It happens to the best of us, I'm afraid. So anyway, I'm going to go and start editing today's video. Well, no. Tonight I'm going to start editing the article video. Then I've got to do the Q and A video. Then I've got to do today's vlog. Then I've got to do the podcast. And I've also got to go out at some stage. Fun, fun. I think you've given me a case of insomnia. Myself the wrong idea. Does your heart beat in your whole body? Right, okay, just managed to get the video to accompany today's article edited. It's exporting as we speak. I am 35 minutes behind schedule um, because I spent a half an hour playing with software that I really shouldn't have. It happens. 
Um, but I've got this edited. Um, so really, if you take the half an hour that I was messing around out of the equation, I'm five minutes over how long I thought this would take to do, which isn't bad because I often over underestimate how long it's going to take me to do tasks. I'm getting a lot better at realizing the true time tasks take. So I'm five minutes over schedule. I thought I'd have this done by 11. Um, I spent a half an hour messing around so I didn't start till a half an hour later which means half 11 was really the deadline once I started it's 25 to 12 this is exporting the image to go along with this video is already created because it's the same as the article image so that's cool don't have to create another image I just need to wait for this to export then upload to YouTube embed the video and hit publish and then it's done so hopefully this doesn't take too long to export okay so I'm just waiting on the video to accompany today's article to upload and I'm getting the same problem I did yesterday. Yesterday I tried to upload a video using my phone as the hotspot and it stalled on 92% and I thought oh, it's obviously my internet connection but I'm in the office connected to the Wi-Fi and it's again stalled at 92% so I am wondering if there is a major problem somewhere with YouTube. This is kind of messing me up because it's taken a lot longer to do than it should so let's hope it doesn't take too much longer or i may have to abandon the process and start all over again we'll see right okay um today's video to accompany the article is edited uploaded the article is live the social promotion is scheduled i did spend some time playing around with co-schedule so for those of you who would follow the vlog would know we use Meet Edgar for all of our social promotion. Um, I've decided to try co-schedule for two weeks uh, in conjunction with Meet Edgar. So I'm not cancelling what's happening with Meet Edgar. Because if we decide to stay there, I don't want to have to go back and redo all that. So I'm going to put the two of them side by side and see what happens. Um, but all that is programmed to go out now over the next couple of days for the promotion of this new article, which just went live. Um so i still need to edit today's q a i need to edit today's vlog and i need to edit the podcast to go out on thursday but as it stands it is almost 1 30 i'm going to take a break i'm going out for a while uh, get out of the office and i will get back in about an hour or so and uh, see how we get on then i think first thing when i come back in will be to get the q a done um simply because I know I have to do today's vlog, whereas if I do today's vlog, I might decide, meh, I won't bother with the q and I'll do that tomorrow, um, whereas once I do the Q&A, the vlog has to go out today. So, that will get done, and then we'll see how we go with the podcast. It all depends on how quick it is, but yeah, I'm going to take a break, go and get some lunch, and uh, I'll be back in about an hour or so, and uh, kick on from back in the office, four o'clock. Gonna get back to work now and get two days Q and A out, and then look after the vlog, and then we'll see how we go with the Chris Tucker podcast episode. So, back to it. I think I might be holding on to you a little too tight. You turn your back when we shut off the light. Have a good one. Six o'clock, just managed to get the Q&A edited and uploaded to YouTube. I've got the Facebook teaser created and also uploaded to Facebook. Um, so that's that job done. And now I am going to take a break for an hour. I've got to make some dinner for the family. I'm going to come back and I'm going to edit today's vlog. So hopefully back in the office by about seven. Get today's vlog edited and ready to go by half eight is generally when I have the social promotion for that out every day. So I've got an hour and a half to get today's vlog edited and uploaded and then i'll see how i go about editing the podcast to go out on thursday but uh yeah i'm gonna go get my food and uh, i'll be back so um this is just gonna be a short update because i spent a lot of time working on the blog today so um what did i do i've got an article coming out on thursday um and the premise is going to be around how to create content that people want uh, and what I'm kind of focusing on is creating content, and not the obvious stuff, but the kind of less obvious stuff. So 
maybe treating the content as if it's a product itself and all of the key steps involved in doing that so as in what problem does it solve you know how much time is it going to take somebody to actually read your content do you know what other resources might be needed for example will they need to buy some software to implement a fix or to solve the problem um, will they need to you know maybe spend a bit of time learning another piece of software uh, is it another guide that you're going to be providing so ultimately what other costs are there you know what are the risks what can go wrong so if you advise somebody to put a plugin on their site for example you know what risks are associated with that so maybe the performance of the website could go downhill so there are certain risks that get there and ultimately working towards that there is a cost for anybody to take action on content that you provide even if you provide it for free so that is something which I speak about um, and overall that is the value proposition so we're really used to using that language talking about products but maybe less so about content and especially free content so that's uh, quite good other than that uh, working on the 30 minute blogger module 5 I did some editing on and module 6 I am working on at the moment just finishing off um, I had a phone call from Phil there so we were just chatting away um, so I'm going to get back to it and finish that part off now um, and that's kind of the key reason why this is short there's a lot of stuff getting done so I'm going to leave it there um, and I look forward to chatting to you tomorrow right five past eight and I've just got today's vlog uploaded edited uploaded social promotion all done and dusted and I'm gonna call it there it didn't get near the editing task that I wanted to get for the Chris Stoker podcast which will go live on Thursday but that's can be done tomorrow um in fact bar editing tomorrow's vlog that'll be the only other task that i really have that'll be pressing and um, i do want to try and write next tuesday's article if i can but i'm going to call it there i'm off to the gym my training has suffered the last couple of days with the heavy workload so i want to get to the gym get a workout in and uh, yeah that's it from me chat to you later Thank <laughs> you.